Hey there, welcome to Storytime with Stacy. I'm Stacy, and I got this great book here. I'm just looking at the cool cover. It's so pretty. And the author Kelly sent it to me. It's called, What Does It Mean to Be Brave? Isn't this a nice book? It's such a nice book. So if you want to go ahead and get settled, we'll get started, okay? So are you ready to read? I am too. Let's do it. What does it mean to be brave? Words by Kelly Shudo. Illustrations by Maria Burrow-Bikina. What does it mean to be brave? Does being brave mean climbing a mountain? Does being brave mean swimming with sharks? Does being brave mean singing a song on a stage? Does being brave mean going to the moon? Does being brave mean walking into a dark cave? Does being brave mean jumping from the highest diving board? Being brave isn't just big and scary things in far off places. Being brave happens every day. Being brave isn't the same for everyone. Different people need to be brave for different things. Being brave means asking a friend to play with you. Being brave means trying a new food. Being brave means saying sorry when you make a mistake. Being brave means telling your friends how they hurt your feelings and then telling them what you need to feel better. Being brave means being proud of yourself even when something doesn't work out the way you had hoped. Being brave means being kind even when other people aren't. Being brave means asking for help when you need it. Being brave means trying something hard just one more time. Being brave means making good choices for yourself, even when your friends don't make the same choices as you. Being brave means making the choice to be confident, even when you don't feel confident. Being brave means being exactly who you are. When were you brave today? The end. You know, before this story, I thought you had to do these really big things. These really big things to be brave. But they can be small things. Like right now, I'm being brave reading the story to you. Because sometimes it's scary to read stories to, to a lot of people. Mm -hmm. It can be. But if you would like to grab a copy of this book so you can read it again and again, I got a link below where you can learn more about the author and you can get your own copy.
Isn't that so cool? I thought so. And then the project for today. It says, I am brave when. And then you can draw a picture of when you were brave. It could be today. It could have been sometime last week, maybe last month, maybe yesterday. Yeah, whenever you were brave, you can draw a picture. And then if you need help with the words, you can have a grown-up help you with the words right up here. And then I had a really fun time coloring in this spaceship and this planet here. And you can do that too. And then I would really like to know when you were brave. Oh, and I almost forgot to say, I've put, I am brave when I stand up for my friends. Because I don't like it when people are mean to my friends. That That's being a bully. So I like standing up for my friends. But here I got, you can share with me when you were brave. I would love to see you when you were brave, okay? Thank you so much for joining me today. Whether you've been here before or whether this is your first time, I am so glad you're here. And I would love for you to join me at my next story time. So if you want to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell, that way you'll know when my next story time is. Isn't that neat how that works? I thought so too. Well, until next time, stay brave, keep reading, and I look forward to seeing you again soon. Bye!